What is your opinion of the rapper Trina? Y'all don't even know, like, when you asked me that question, I had this feeling in my heart. Like, you know when you get butterflies when you really like someone? Like, I love Trina. I just, I've been listening to Trina since I was a kid. Like, I remember me and my homegirl um, got kicked out of, I think it was like our ninth grade language arts class because we was like rapping Trina lyrics and we was turning up and dancing and we got kicked out of class. Like. I've always loved Trina. She keeps it real. She got all the game. She's the baddest bitch. Like, she living the glamorous life. Like, I just love Trina. Have you ever had a chance to meet her? No. If I meet Trina, I will cry. <laughs> I will cry. All I'll these have, times you've, you've... I will have that moment. Like, that, that fan moment that's, like, crying at the concert. Like, like they're shaking. Like, I feel like, I feel like that... I would do that if I met Trina. I would try to hold it together, you know, so that we could take pictures and I could still, like, look nice. But I feel like I would cry. All these times going to Miami, you've never bumped I've into never her? I've never bumped into Trina. I've never just bumped into her. I need to go out more. Now, what's your favorite song of hers? Um... Okay, so this is funny because if you like try to search this on SoundCloud or even like Apple Music or just whatever, it comes up under Trick Daddy, but it's by Trina and it's called For All My Ladies. And it's like, that's some throwback, throwback Trina. That's your but favorite. But it's called For All My Ladies. Now, are you familiar with her bag of chips? No, I've never had them. Have you heard of them? Have you, have you seen I've her heard, promoting I've, this? I've never seen Trina specifically, but I heard that like like Migos have like some chips or Rap something snacks. like that. So I don't if it's the same brand or not, but that's it. I've just only heard of the Migos because it's called like Dabber Ranch. Have you ever tasted them? I've never had them. Oh, okay. I've never well, had this them. Will be I've just seen it before, like in the store. She has her own flavor of wrap snacks, which okay. are chips. She actually has two flavors. Okay. And let me just break down what wrap snacks are for people that don't know. Wrap snacks is a snacking company, uh, but they have a primary focus in chips, potato chips, and uh, all kinds of other chips now. That's cool. And they have a different wrapper representing a different flavor of each of their bags. And now... They have collab Butrina for two of those, and we have one of those okay, flavors okay. today. So without you seeing oh this, just what are you imagining just of what you know of Trina? I know Trina's about her money. She's about being glamorous. She's about diamonds and living lavish. So I could just, I don't know, like. I would think maybe it got something to do with money or I, I can't even imagine a, like what flavor, but I just, I don't know. <laughs> well, let's see what this looks like. Okay. okay we have okay, it so to the side of you face down. Now's the time to go ahead and peek and oh grab my gosh. them. And... Hold on. I got to look at the back because her picture's on here and her hair's laid. Let the chips fall where they lay and where they land is where they stay. <laughs> yes, Trina. So you have before we even <laughs> dissect this bag because you're going a little ahead of where I wanted to go. Check oh, out sorry. the front. Check out the front. Okay, this is yeah. the front. Okay, honeydew. I see. I like it. It looks just like Trina. The picture is really nice. I love it. It's beautiful. Can I show this to you guys? Yes. Show. Bring it up a little higher. There we go. Okay, that's it. Like YouTube. <laughs> and now you, you look at the back which you've already uh, kind of talked about. Yes. Uh, she has a quote at the top of the bag. Yes, Every rapper has quote. their own quote. And then also above that barcode is a QR code. And for people that don't oh, know what that is. Oh, they can like take a picture of it or something. How yes, works? every bag is scannable. Get exclusive music, content, and surprises by swiping the QR code. Okay, that's dope. That's dope. Um, yes, I love this. Honeydew cheese puffs. You ever heard of a flavor like that before? No, I'm re I want to get into it. I let's see. Let's it. see what this smells like. This is a perfect name, Honeydew, because, you know, Trina is sexy and she's just like, yeah. So Honeydew is like really cute. That's a good name. Cheese puffs. So Trina's about her cheddar. See what this smells like. Let's see what this tastes like. Let's start with this. Go ahead and grab one. 
or smell one. Mm, it smells like, like, like cheese, but it kind of like a sweet, like a blend. Does it smell like honeydew? Like the yeah, honey? you can you can smell like the well the the cheese smell is pretty strong. Okay. But but you can smell like there's something sweet there. So okay. that's the honeydew, and um, they're like puffs. So Let's see what these taste like. Now give these a <laughs> give these a second. Let these marinate. Okay. It's bomb. <laughs> can I have, yeah, I can take these. Yes, of course. <laughs> This is your bag. They have like a good. Mm -hmm. Now you would be honest, even though she is no, I'm an artist. No, I'm gonna keep If you didn't like them, you would tell us. Because constructive criticism, there's nothing wrong with that. They're good. Okay, so these are honeydew cheese puffs. Do you taste honeydew? Do you taste cheese? More Ooh, cheese so than honeydew. So let me tell you what they're giving. Okay, so I really like these. Um, this company did a great job. I would say it looks like like a Cheeto, like Cheetos brand puff, but these ones are better. I feel like Cheeto puffs, they're supposed to be puffs, but they kind of a little rough, a little like, you know, sometimes when I eat Cheeto puffs, my tongue be kind of dry feeling or the roof of my mouth be feeling a little rough. Mm. These are like melting in my mouth. Like, I feel like, they, it would just like melt in my mouth and I wouldn't even have to chew it. Like they're so soft and they have like the cheese flavor, but it, I could taste like the honeydew, like the sweetness of it. And I think it's a good blend. Like I, I think that like when you like mix like, you know, like, uh, like sweet and sour or sweet and spicy. Anytime you mix like sweet with something, I think it just gives it like that kick of flavor. So it doesn't just taste like straight cheese, but it just tastes really good. Not straight cheese. Are you saying 50-50 or a little yeah, more cheese? Yeah, you because could you could taste the sweetness of it, but then you can still taste the cheese. So it's not like a, just a straight cheese flavor like the Cheeto brand. I, I think these are better. Mm -hmm. When you first bite into it, is it more cheese first than sweet after, or is it a mix of both? Or sweet when you first, first bite sweet? into it, it's cheese. But because they're so fluffy and soft, they literally kind of like melt in your mouth and then you can taste the sweet. I love them. Now, let's say the people at Rap Snacks are watching this, listening to this interview. Mm -hmm. And let's say it's your turn to be on a bag of snacks. And it doesn't necessarily have to be chips. It could be any snack, right? What snack would you want? How would your packaging look? What color scheme, maybe? I don't know. What would you want? Um, damn, that's crazy. Yeah, I have I'm, to think <laughs> about that. Um, mine would definitely be sweet and spicy, something. Because I'm sweet, but I'm spicy. But um, what particular flavor would I want? Maybe I can do like a sweet and spicy barbecue. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sweet and spicy barbecue. Yeah, I think that would that would work for me. Um, I would want it to be kind of like, hmm, what color would I want the bag to be? Yeah, what color scheme? I think I would definitely want some purple. Um, maybe like a purple kind of, like I like how like this color, what would we call this? Like a nude or like a, like a nude or not really white, like but a like an off-white tan. Off tan. I think that that would do me right. Like a purple and like a off-white, you know, sweet and spicy barbecue. 